Hello, everybody. How are you guys? Welcome, welcome. Thank you guys so much for being here. I've got a new setup tonight for my ring live. I hope you guys can see it. I'm going to adjust it just a little bit so that we can get a good shot of these rings. I am super excited to be here with you tonight. Make sure you share this video out. I hope you guys can see them nicely. Hopefully my camera will do its job. We're trying a new little setup. This is not permanent. This is just for tonight. And if you see the little live button up at the top left corner of your screen, that means that you are catching this video live. If you do not see it, then that means that you are watching the replay, but that is okay. You can still shop with me. All you have to do to claim is comment the number or the description of the item that I give you. If you've never watched my live videos before, my name is Rosalinda. You can't see my face today because we're showing rings. I wanted to get the camera really nice and close to the rings for you so that we can focus on the detail of all of these gorgeous beauties. So if you haven't seen any of my videos, make sure you scroll through my business page. Check out the other videos that I have available. I've got a ton of other videos available um, on my business page that you can shop the replays on. So tonight we are looking at rings and I've got a ton of them to show you. All different colors, all different sizes. Um, so that's going to be a fun night, okay? Hi, Rosa. Welcome. Thank you for being here. Rosa got word of the night. Okay, so if you want to subscribe to my text alerts, all you have to do to subscribe is text the um, at the keyword at shiny gems to 81010 to subscribe to the text alerts okay and let me go ahead and um i will write that down on a piece of paper for you so that you can understand i actually have never done this before like this but i think it's a great idea since we're here so let me, let me see if i can write it down on this so you text at shiny gems Two eight one zero one zero. There it is, you guys. Text at Shiny Gems to eight one zero one zero to subscribe to the text alerts. And it's absolutely free to subscribe. Okay. So with that being said, here it is again in case you want to screenshot it. So you text the at symbol like if you were doing an email address, shiny gems to 81010. That's a uh, number. And when you do that, you subscribe to the text alerts. Um, and that's how Rosa gets free bling, girl. She is fast. So if anyone is looking for a race and y'all want to race against Rosa, um, it used to be um, Isabel who used to always get it. But Rosa has been on a roll lately. <laughs> All right, here we go. We're going to start with the ring sale. Um, feel free to share this video out. It's on the left side of your screen. And we will get started with this one here. This is a blue ring with a blue stone. It's got that blue stone in the center and all of that beautiful filigree all over. I really, really love this. This is so cute. So this one will be blue ring if you want that one. Blue ring for this one here. Blue ring for that one. That one is adorable. I love that. So that one will be blue ring to claim. My next one is this one in red. This has a red, like a little bit of a red stone in the center and it looks like a flower almost like a sunflower so if you like this one you can say red flower red flower for that one. Ooh, i love this one this is a little skinny stretch back ring this is a skinny stretch back here i'll take it off of my finger so i can show it to you like this it's a little skinny stretch back ring there's the skinny part and it's got like a little green emerald little green emerald gems if you like this one it will be green ring green ring oh it's out of focus there it is how pretty is that oh my gosh rosa i understand the COVID shot oh my goodness oh my goodness yeah i totally get it i have um i've been there it you feel a little crud for a little bit and then you like you start to feel a little better like a couple days after this is green ring for that one and i only have one of those so, yeah, definitely get to feeling better. Rest. I recommend, like, sleeping. Oh, my gosh. Sleeping felt so great when I <laughs> when I had that. Okay, so this is a red pearl ring. This one's got, like, a little tiara at the very top. It looks so cute. It's got that red pearl in the center and all of those beautiful rhinestones. That's going to be R66. R66 for that one. 
Next, I've got this green um, ring with a moonstone. That one's got all of those crystals all around and that green moonstone in the center. That's going to be R76. R76 for this green ring here. Next, we've got a red stone ring. This one's really pretty. It's got all of that silver like filigree all over the sides, kind of giving it such a pretty frame on that red stone. That's going to be just red ring, red ring for that one. If you're just coming on in, hello, welcome. We are doing a flash sale on rings tonight. All of the rings are only $5. They are all lead and nickel free. Some of them are big stretch back. Some of them are skinny stretch back. And we've got all different sizes and all different colors and all different styles. This one is a pink ring. You can say pink ring for this one. It's got all the silver and in the center, it's got that pink stone. Now the other ring I showed you was a blue ring. It was exactly the same, just in blue. So if you want this one, you can say pink ring pink ring for that one this is r60 r60 has these little cute little pinky stones and all of those really pretty rhinestones kind of wrapped around the outsides but that um, baguette cut stone in the center is in pink so that's going to be r60 r60 for that one i've shown this before this has a, a rose quartz in the center it's like a marble rose quartz i love this three big rose quartz stones you can say rose ring rose rng uh, r-i-n-g for this one ring can she spell rose r-i-n-g <laughs> rose ring <laughs> next i have this one with a pink stone in the center this one's more of a dome ring you see it's got that like dome shape with that really pretty acrylic stone and pink in the center that's going to be r19 r19 for that one and there is that pink stone i love that that's really pretty Lots of pink rings. This is turquoise. This one's actually one of my favorites. It's just got that beautiful, like, turquoise stone in the center. Those three big stones. Little peekaboos on the side. Really cute. That one's going to be blue ring if you want that one. Also one of my faves. Look at this. This is super cute. That is a pink enamel on there on a silver, like a silver hardware. It's got a big stretch back. But this one is so cute. It's like a little flower. It's, like, perfect for summertime. I could see it with like red pink, uh, pink wood earrings. That would be a cute one, like those little flower earrings I've showed you before. So that's gonna be pink flower, pink flower for that one to claim it. I'm gonna swipe the comments really quick. This is, oh, this one's called like something ice. I think it's called like what, what um, ice or something. I don't remember. It's gonna be green ring if you want this one. Green ring, isn't that super pretty? I've got a ton of uh, rings tonight, you guys, so make sure you are sharing the video out for me, please. You know I always enter you guys into a giveaway when you do, um, and you can just claim by the number that I give you or the description. So this is green ring, green ring for that one. This is pink ring, uh, pink stone. You can say pink stone ring for this one. I only have one of these, only one, pink stone ring for that one. Oh my gosh, Rosa, really? That your jaw is hurting? You know what happened to me, Rosa? My legs were hurting so bad, but only on one side of my body. Like only one side. This is pink stone ring. Thank you, Angela. Yes, that ring is so beautiful. This is red a ring, red ring for this one. I love this. It's got that big red stone in the center. You can say red gem ring or red crystal ring for that one. That one's really pretty. My hands. Am I, am I a good hand model tonight? Probably not, huh? <laughs> I should get one of those fake silicone hands to do the ring lines. <laughs> this is red stone gem or red, uh, red stone ring for that one. Hi, Lillian. Thank you, Melissa, for sharing. Um, this is a blue moonstone. Blue moonstone. It's got that crystal all down the front of it. And that big blue moonstone right smack in the center. Now, this one I have in white also. So you can claim blue moonstone for this one. Or you can claim the white one. The white one is going to be R38. R38 for the white. And blue moonstone for the blue. Okay? That's how you can claim those. Those are pretty. Those are big and pretty. I love them. Okay, so this is a mix stone ring. You've got those little blue turquoise um, stones and the 
yellow turquoise stones. So this is going to be a, a, you can say yellow ring, <laughs> yellow stone ring for that one. <laughs> yellow stone ring. And it's got just a little bit of those really pretty, um, like silver pieces on the sides. Red stone, uh, yellow stone ring, not red. What's red about that? Yellow stone ring. <laughs> That's what that one looks like. That one's really pretty. Okay. Yellow stone. Um, you got them, um, Veronica, the blue and the white for you. You got it, girl. Okay, so this one is also blue moonstone. You got it, Melissa. Thank you. This is a blue moonstone ring, and this one is really pretty. It's like a teardrop shape, and it's got all of that crystal. You guys, this is beautiful. This one's such a pretty ring. I love this cat's eye or moonstone um, in the center. So if you want this one, you can say, let's do blue teardrop, blue teardrop. I think I only have one of these available. Blue teardrop for that one. Isn't that beautiful though? Look at that. That's freaking gorgeous. Okay. Blue teardrop for that one. This one here is a smaller ring also in blue, but it's got more of like an aqua ish blue stone. And then it's got those little flowers on the side. See those little flowers? Those are so cute. Love that one. This is going to be R21. R21 for this one. I think I have this in yellow. Yes, it's right here. Look. So, oops. If you want R21, you can say R21 in blue. I'll turn the tag over so you can see the tag. R21 in blue or R21 in yellow. For this one it's got that same flower on the side they're just two different colors aren't those pretty r21 blue r21 yellow for those all right next oh this is pretty because i have a an earring for this this is going to be r75 you got it veronica blue teardrop for you that's the last one i have in that one this is R75. R75 is a pink crackle stone ring, but the pink is like a neon. I'm bringing it in and out of frame because I'm putting it on my finger. <laughs> but this is so pretty. Look at how pretty that is. It is a bigger stretch back. This is going to be R75 for the pink um, crackle stone or like the pink sandstone. That's a really pretty one. Next up, I've got a blue turquoise ring. Now, this one is very simple. It's just got that elongated, like, oval-shaped stone. And then on the sides, it's got the dotted um, texture, like the dotted little pieces. And I think that is super fun. I love that one. So that's going to be blue ring, blue stone ring for that one. I think I only have one of these, okay? Blue stone ring for that one. Next, I have this one. Now, this one is also a blue stone ring. And we're going to give this one number 11. We'll give it number 11 for that one. But this one is so beautiful. It's a little bit longer than the other one. And I'll put them right next to each other so you can see them both at the same time. But this one's got just a little bit more of that detail around. It's got like more silver detail. You see this here? This is the first one I showed you. This is blue stone ring, if you want that one. And this is number 11 for this one. That one is so pretty. It's just a little bit longer. Hi, Sonia. Ooh, you are you eating a banana shake, Maggie? Oh, my gosh. Is it from Sonic? I really want one. Oh, my gosh. Really, really want one. Oh, that sounds so good. Ah, okay, this is pink. <laughs> Thank you for sharing, Maggie. This is pink here. Um, and this has a like a big pink stone here on the oops, I just bumped you on the side here or on the bottom or top. I mean, it just depends on how you want to wear it. You can wear it like that or you can wear it like this. And this is going to be oh, we can say pink ring for this one. Oh, Sonia, Rosa already beat you to it. This is a hematite crystal on the top, like a baguette cut stone. And then that center stone is pink. So you can say pink ring for this one. This is such a cute ring. I love this. No, I am craving one. Oh, Maggie. <laughs> I'm craving it too now, Maggie. Thanks a lot. <laughs> I'm craving it too now. It sounds so good. You said banana shake and I thought of like 
a really good shake from Sonic. Oh my gosh, sounds so good. I might have to drive through one in a little bit. This is going to be Red Gem Ring. Red Gem. Red G-E-M. Um, and I have this in blue and pink, and I showed them to you earlier. Here's the blue one. These are awesome. Look, there's the blue one. And then here's the pink one also. So I've got them in all three colors. Aren't those beautiful colors, though? That's a stunning um, ring there. It is big, and it's got that big stretch back. But I just think it's beautiful. Like, I can imagine it with a beautiful dress, maybe something um, something very elegant, like for prom or for, um, like, an, an event or something, like a dance. I would love this ring. This is beautiful. Look at that. So this is going to be red, um, red ring. You could do a dance in that or, like, you know what I mean, like a gala or a special dinner. That would be beautiful. Ooh, orange dreamsicle shake. That sounds so good. Okay, this is a circle. You can say circle red ring. Circle red ring for this one. It's just got that big red stone in the center and all of those beautiful gemstones all the way around. Love that. It's like a mini crystal gemstone on that one. That is beautiful. Okay, red. Um, I already forgot. Oh, circle red ring or circle ring in red for that one. This is green. Look at that. This is so pretty. So this is a, um, this is more of like a, I, I can't describe this color. It's more of like, not a forest green. It's like, um, what would you call this? Like a primary green almost. It's very beautiful green color. And it's got those really pretty crystals on the side. And it does have some peekaboos. I call the little pieces where you can see my skin through peekaboos. But that is so pretty. I love that. And it is a skinny stretch back ring. So very simple to wear. You can say green ring for that one. This one's got a blue gem. Blue gem for this one. That is so pretty. It's just got that big blue gem in the center. And then all of those gorgeous rhinestones on the side. I don't have to chew a shake, right? Yeah, that's perfect, Maggie, right now. Take advantage of it. You know what I really want now that you guys are saying shakes? I also want a um, like a soft serve ice cream. Oh my God, that would be so good right now. So you can say blue gem for that one. All right, you guys, I'm gonna pause for just a second because I'm, um, I'm gonna get my numbers so that I have them. I'm so like silly. And I didn't grab the numbers for the flash sale today. So I went and grabbed them. Okay, they're right here. I'm going to put them right here. All right, next one is going to be a pink one. This pink one here has those little pink crystals on the, like, on the little flowers. And it's going to be number 111. Oh, these are backwards. Well, that's not going to help me. Okay, never mind. We're going to use these right here. <laughs> We're going to do number 60. That's better. <laughs> Number 60 for this one. <laughs> that is super cute. Love, love that. It's got those little flowers and then the gems in the center. So number 60 for that one in pink. Okay, we're going to keep going. Got a ton more to show you. Number 60 for the pink one. Okay, are you ready for some silver ones? Because these are gorgeous. This is one of my blockbusters. I sell this ring so much. It is so stunning. It's just got like a dome shape to it. But do you see how pretty that is? It's just a really, really simple silver crystal ring. That one is going to be number 23. We'll do 23 for that one. Isn't that so pretty? I'm going to take it off so I can show it to you like this. Woo, girl, that is beautiful. So that's going to be a 23 for that one. Next, I have... This one looks like it's got a little crown. This is such a pretty one, too. It's got nothing but crystals and then that big stone in the center. It looks like it's got a little crown at the very top. I love this, too. So this one will be number 15. 15 for that one. That is gorgeous. Love that. Okay, next we've got... This is a ring from uh, Empower Me Pink, and this is stunning. Look at that one. This one's got more of like a peak at the top and the bottom. 
look like vanilla ice cream yes <laughs> this has a little peak at the top and the bottom like little um what do you call it like a little marquise cut crystal and then it's got that teardrop in the center and it's a bigger ring so it's gonna look a little like that on your finger it's like it's got more of an elongated look so that's gonna be r48 r48 for that one that's a really pretty one too r48 I've got, this is a like a cushion. No, this is a circle cut stone. So I think these circle cut stones are called, um, are called, what do you call them? A princess cut maybe? I need to get the gem, the gem cuts. Hi Mireya, welcome girl. So this one is a circle or princess cut. I think that's what it's called. And then you've got the crystals all the way around. And then down at the bottom, you've got, or um, in the back, you've got a skinny stretch back. So this is like, I love these skinny stretch back ones. You guys know how I feel about them. They're just so nice and so comfy. Look at that. That's beautiful. That one is going to be number 73. 73 for this one. Absolutely beautiful with that skinny stretch back. Cute, cute. That one is like really nice little one. All right, this is also a, um, this one's also one of my, my blockbusters. It's got the crystals on the three, like, it's got, like, three layers. I'll bring it up closer so you can see. It's got those, like, three layers. This one's mine. <laughs> this is my showpiece. And it does have a, a, a big stretch back on the back. I wear this ring so much. I love it. Look how beautiful it is. I've had it for a long time. And I love the way that it looks. This one's going to be number 61. If you want one, I've got a ton. So I'll give you a brand new one. <laughs> number 61 for this one. 61. All right. Next, I've got this. This reminds me of the Empire State Building. Look at this. This is gorgeous. It's got those peaks on the top and the bottom. And then those little hematite crystals all the way um, through, like the, the little peaks or like the little they look like lightning almost i don't know how to even describe it it's absolutely beautiful so this is going to be number 17 we'll do 17 for this one that's such a pretty one 17 let's see what other one is very interesting that i love oh this one all right this is r53 r53 and i've only got a few of these available r53 looks like this baby oh round cut princess cut square oh thank you angela look how pretty this is y'all that is like a flower on top of a flower it is so stunning and these are little marquise cut crystals creating this like flower petal look i love this Reminds me of the movie Thor. Yeah, Melissa, that is so true. It reminds me of like lightning or something. Or the Empire State Building, like New York. This is so beautiful. This is a flower ring. So that one's going to be R53. We're, and if you're coming on in just now, we're talking about this ring here. That reminds Melissa of the movie Thor. <laughs> I love that thing. R53 for the flower ring. If you're watching the replay, let me know in the comments that you're watching the replay. Leave me a hashtag replay. And um, I appreciate you so much for watching the replay. I love my replay watchers. This one here is like a cushion um, cut or square or square cut stone. So maybe this one is the princess cut, Angela. This is absolutely gorgeous. And it's got a little peekaboo on the side. It is also a skinny stretch back. So it's super, super simple, but so pretty. That big stone here, who's getting married? Is she getting married? Girl, she's engaged. That's so beautiful. <laughs> this one's going to be number 32. This will be 32. Look at that. That is stunning. So, so nice. Beautiful, beautiful. For five bucks, 32 for that one. That is so cute. You got it, Maggie. I got you for um r53 that one's so beautiful maggie you're gonna love that that thing is awesome that's my walmart ring <laughs> another cutie little tiny ring that's got a skinny stretch back is this one here it'll focus it this one's got a teardrop stone in the center and then it's got more of like um 
like a peak or like a little crown on top of it. Also skinny stretch back. Super cute. You can wear it with the peak down or with the peak up, depending on how you want to style it. And you saw it is so tiny and cute. I'll show it to you on this finger here. Isn't that so cute? That's adorable. And there's the skinny back. So this one will be number 89. 89 for this one. Isn't that adorable? That's a cute one too. I just think the small ones, they like, I don't know, they pull at my heartstrings. Okay, this one, <laughs> this one here has a little white pearl. Now, I showed you this one with the red pearl, but if you have any pearl items, like maybe a pearl bracelet or a pearl necklace that you want to pair it up with, you can. This one's got that little crown at the top, and it's called like something tiaras. Like, um, I forgot the name of this, but it's called something tiaras, and it's so cute. Also skinny stretch back. Lots of skinny back rings tonight. This is going to be number 25. And those are my favorite. I don't know why I like them. I just think they're so dainty and cute. 25 for that one. All right. Next I have this one that's also skinny. But this one's got a little cluster of pearls in the center. So if you wanted to wear one on one hand and one on the other, they're both pearl rings. Really cute. This one here has the little cluster of pearls and little like silver detail on the side. Hi, Danette. Welcome, girl. This one will be number 86. 86 for that one. Isn't that super cute? Adorable in silver. 86 for that pearl ring. All right. This one is one of my classic favorites. It's got a dotted detail on the top, and then it's got that black stone right smack in the center. It's got a little texture on that bottom ring. It looks like you've stacked a couple rings together. Um, it is a thicker stretch back, so it looks like a stacker. That is such a cute one. Number 69 for that one. 69 for the silver and black stone ring. 69. Now, this one I've shown you guys a couple times. I think I might have shown it once or twice this past week. This is the big um, opal and turquoise ring. So these stones here on the side are opal. And then in the center, you get that big turquoise stone. It's so stunning. That is a beautiful one. I love it. Okay, so if you want this one, you can say 66. 66 for this one. Isn't that cute, y'all? That's adorable. <laughs> I just love that. I think I like how big it is, but I also like the stones on that. Okay, I'm going to move the comments a little bit. I'll be like a rich. <laughs> yeah, Maggie, that's so true. <laughs> this one is a more of a rectangular cut crystal with those really cute little like um, square cut crystals all around the side. I think this was one from Fashion Fix. This one will be R58, R58, and it is a thicker stretch back, but a lovely crystal in the center. That is gorgeous. R58 for that one. Let's see, let me show you some colorful ones. I'm gonna start pulling from I'm going to start pulling some orange, some uh, copper, and some rose gold. This one's one of my favorite rose gold rings. I'm, like, surprised I even still have it. I might have, like, a couple left. Also, skinny stretch back. That one's R54. R54 is going to be a skinny stretch back in uh, rose gold. And it's just got those little crystals on there. I think this is a cutie little everyday ring. Like if you like wearing rings on a daily basis, this is like one that you can wear um, every day. Because it's really cute, small, and very like it goes with everything. So R54 in rose gold for that one. Next in rose gold is this one here. This one looks more of like a... Um, like a treble clef. That's what it reminds me of. This is going to be R68. And I don't know how many I have of these. I might have maybe two left. But it's super pretty. Very ornate. Elegant. With that um, really pretty design in the center. So that one's going to be R68. R68 for that one. Now I've got R78. R78 has these teardrop crystals in like a smoky. 
And then it's got those small smoky crystals kind of on the side. So that's R78, thicker stretch back. And that's what that one looks like. That one's really pretty too. R78 for that one. This one here is a flower ring in white. You can say white flower for this one. It's just got that beautiful like mandala flower in silver, thicker stretch back. And then the center you get like a stark white um, stone. I think this would look really pretty with a um, like a French manicure because of the white tips on your nails, you know, and it would match the white ring. I think it would look really, really nice. So this here is white ring, white ring for that one or white flower. Next in flowers, this is a cute little summer ring. This one's got like little daisies all in silver, thicker stretch back. So you can say silver flower for this one, silver flower. For that one there. Really cutie one. This one is in gunmetal. And I love this because this is just like a really simple, like infinity symbol ring in gunmetal got a thicker stretch back also but all gunmetal you can say gunmetal crisscross for that one gunmetal crisscross in um copper i think this is a shiny copper or a blush copper this one's got all of these beautiful gems look at that that is so stunning here i'll take it off my finger so you can kind of see here the copper detail on it and all of the crystals that's going to be r82 for that one r82 that is so pretty one of my faves the heart ring this is number r62 and you've got a red crystal and then like a silver sparkle um, heart in there too so you got a heart going like to the side almost this is a skinny stretch back ring R62 for that one. This one's also skinny stretch back. It's got a little black stone in the center. It looks like a little lotus flower almost. Very pretty design. Just a simple little black stone right in the center and um, a skinny stretch back. That one's going to be black ring. Black ring for that one. <laughs> I'm laughing at Maggie's comment. <laughs> that is hilarious. This is R83. R83 is just like the red, uh, green one I showed you. I showed you a green one in this style. This one's got the hematite stones, all silver hematite. R83 for that one. Next is this one. That's got a black stone in the center and the flowers on the side. This is a bit of a thicker ring because you've got the little peekaboos through the flower petals. Thicker stretch back. That's going to be number 46. 46 for this one. I like the flower motif on it. That's really pretty. 46 for that one. R14 looks like this. It's got this, um, like almost like a hematite crystal or a smoky crystal in the center. All silver. Tons of texture on this. Really beautiful. R14 for that one. And I'll put this one on so you can kind of see. That's what that looks like. Really simple, but a little bit of sparkle. R14 for that one. I've got another moonstone ring. This one is in black. Really gorgeous. You can say black moonstone for that. It's got nothing but crystals all the way around, but then that black moonstone right in the center. This one's so beautiful. Look at that. I like that it's very classic. It's just got that black stone right smack in the center. Black moonstone for that one. This is an all silver ring. It's just got no bling, just a lot of tribal pattern, super simple, but love the texture on it. I think it's a good stacker if you wanted to wear a ring on this finger or a ring on this finger that kind of sits midi length right here. You could totally pop that on. So that's going to be a silver texture ring for that one silver texture ring this is one of my faves this is a large teardrop crystal ring this is one of my favorites i love it so much it's so so big but so beautiful for five bucks this is incredible this one's gonna be number 49 
It's got that big tour, um, big uh, teardrop. And then all of the crystals on the side of that one. Super pretty. So number 49 for that. Okay. This one is in orange. That's got an orange crackle stone right in the center and a ton of those beautiful um, textured like dotted details on the sides. This is also a thicker stretch back, number 31. I don't know if I've already said that. <laughs> 31 for this one. Super cute. I love the orange on that. I like the bright colors sometimes. This here has a pearl in the center and then a little bit of a mother of pearl on the bottom of the white. All of those pearls right smack in the middle and then a little bit of the crystal. That's gonna be number 81. 81 for this one and it does have a thicker stretch back 81 Next we've got this one is thick and big It's more of like um, like a bar ring because I, I call them bar rings when they're like really 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 big like this They've got a really elegant texture right smack in the center. No bling on this one. Just a lot of filigree That one will be number 35 35 in all silver have you guys had dinner yet what did you guys have for dinner 35 in silver for that one i um i have not had any dinner <laughs> we've been i've been so lazy i haven't gone to the grocery store either i guess i need to go to the grocery store <laughs> this one is a flower ring in silver all um petals in silver and they kind of like overlap one another this one will be number 90, number 90 in silver. I always ask what you guys have for dinner on the live videos because I am so hungry by the time I go live. <laughs> number 90 for that one. <laughs> then I'm always like, what did you guys have? Tell me what you had. I'm hungry. <laughs> this is R25. That's got a, um, this has a hematite crystal stone. I love it. It's like all big hematite crystals, a little peekaboos on the side. That's going to be R25. Isn't that gorgeous? Love, love, love that one. R25 for that one. Next up, I've got this one I showed last night, I think, or the night before. And it's just got a little hematite crystal baguette cut and then all of those dotted textures. Also skinny stretch back, really simple and small. Love that one. Enchilada dinner? Oh my god, Maggie, that sounds delicious. Oh my god, sounds so good. Eduardo's like, I'm probably gonna have leftovers tonight. And I'm like, oh, I don't know how I feel about that. This is gonna be number 38. <laughs> 38 for this one. I'm like, I don't know if I want leftovers tonight. I'm trying to like, go get me something good. Okay, this is very similar to the one I showed you earlier from EMP but it is on a smaller scale. You've got a ton of the white crystals and then that really pretty white crystal in the center. Thicker stretch back on that one. That's gonna be number 75. Let me grab the number because it's stuck together. I've got a band, uh, I was gonna say Band-Aid, a rubber band, not Band-Aid, <laughs> a rubber band on it. Number 75 for this one. <laughs> Here it is again. Super cute, 75 for that one. I love that, that's like big and bold. Next I've got, I showed you this in pink today, but this one's a baguette cut crystal with a ton of crystals on the top and the bottom, but it's got like that really pretty design, almost like an art deco-y kind of vibe on this one. That's gonna be number 48 for the white crystal ring, 48 for that one. Next, we've got, ooh, this reminds me of a mirror, like a princess mirror, like a mirror, mirror on the wall, Snow White style. It's got those, um, like, little teardrops, and then it, got, it has a frame on it. It's very pretty. It's got a thicker stretch back on that one. This one's going to be number 84. 84 for that one. That sounds so good, Maggie. I am, like, drooling over enchiladas right now. 84. I would make them, but I don't even have the stuff to make them. I was like, what can I make for dinner tonight? Okay, this is a thicker oval design. No bling on this one. It's 
just got a dotted detail and the dots are like smaller and then they get bigger and bigger and bigger as the ring um as the circles get tighter this is such a pretty one it's got a thicker back on that one this is going to be number 54 54 for this one we've got a little flower ring this one's adorable it's got a little flower in the center it looks like a sand dollar all silver thicker stretch back for that one that will be number 63 63 for the circle ring super cute next i have a uh, this is a multi stone ring so you've got a white stone and also a smoky stone but this has like a really cool design like it looks like leaves on a branch or something going up a little bit of a peekaboo through that crystal there and right there super pretty it looks like a little leaf design kind of going up i think that's what i can see this is going to be number 19 number 19 for this one super nice next up we've got this one oh this is pretty this has a smoky stone in the center steak chimichanga but settled for taco sal pastor less chewing <laughs> oh my god that sounds so good y'all are making me hungry over here this is a hematite crystal and then in the center you've got a smoky crystal in like a teardrop shape thicker stretch back on that one that's gonna be at number 44 44 for that one all right, we're gonna do the ones on the um, wood plank and then I will let you guys go for tonight. Thank you guys so much for watching. We're gonna finish it off with these. This is a turquoise stone. This is called like a lotus something, like something lotus, it, cause it's got that shape of like a lotus flower. Very pretty, you see those little lotuses on the side? I love that. So this is gonna be R73, R73 for that one. This one here I showed you at the very beginning. It's silver. It's got like little heart designs on the side. Tons of really pretty silver designs. And then that big blue stone right in the center. You know, this is a big ring. That's really pretty though. So that one's going to be blue ring. Blue stone ring or, or blue ring. We've got my favorite that's been sitting on here. Um, this is R80, and this is a red moonstone ring. It's absolutely beautiful. Look at all those red moonstones on that. Super pretty, thicker stretch back. Love the moonstone and the crystals. That's gonna be R80 for that one. This is pink crystal ring, and it's got that baby pink stone in the center. And then all of the crystals all the way around. So this will be baby pink ring for that one. You got it, Rose. I got you for number 80. Next, I have this one in blue. Now, I showed you this in different colors tonight. I showed it to you in an all white, in a pink. And now I'm showing it to you in the blue. If you like this one, you can say blue gem ring. Blue gem ring for that one. That one is so cute. Baguette cut stone on that. Super pretty. Blue gem ring for that one. This one is also one of my favorite turquoise ones. I don't know if I have more of these. I think this one might be the last one. It's like a flower um, ring. And then it's got all that. All of this is um, stone. So it's not plastic. It's like a real, really pretty turquoise stone on there and then of course you've got a thicker stretch back on that one you got it melissa i got you for r80 that is gonna be um you can say blue flower for this one blue flower oh my god this is gorgeous look at this you guys i almost kept this because this is the last one i have in gold this is nothing like marquee, nothing but marquise cut crystals kind of on the outside. And then in the center, you got nothing but round crystal stones. I love that ring. That's beautiful. It's like a, like a big king's crown almost. That's what I think of when I see this. This is stunning. So that one's going to be number one. Number one for that one. So gorgeous. Hi, star. Welcome so so pretty that's a really pretty one you got it rosa this one i think i've already shown this one to you the pink ring i've got two of them if anyone wants that you can see pink flower for that one 
This one here has a blue crystal in the center. Nothing but gems all the way around. Y'all, this is stunning. That's going to be R69. Make sure you put the R in front of it because I, um, I think I gave 69 um, a ring already. So this one will be R69. It's so stunning. Look at all those crystals. This is so beautiful. R69 for that one. Next we've got, hold on, let me get it all together over here. <laughs> this one here in white. This is a white crackle stone ring. Nothing but crystal, or sorry, nothing but um, silver, like a uh, detail on this. Like um, it's set on a silver um, frame. And this one kind of like peaks up. Can you see that it kind of curves on the ends here? It curves here and it curves here. It kind of curls up. Very pretty. All white crackle stone on that one. If you want this one, you can say number 50. Number 50 for that one. Super pretty. You guys, can anyone tell me how long we've been on? And depending on what the time is, I might show a couple more. I wanted to show you this one here. This is R81. This is just the same as the blue and pink and white. And what other color did I show it to you in? Here, let's look at them. This is the black one. This is the blue one. Ooh, I just bumped you. I'm so sorry. And then we did a pink one. And then we did the white one. That's it. Hold on. Let me find it. Where's the white one? White, white, white. Right here. Look at these. I got them in all different colors. So black, blue, white, and pink. And they are so beautiful. <laughs> they are so cute. I think I kept the pink one and I kept the blue one. I might keep the black one because that's a cute one for the black and white gala for convention. So if you want the black one, it will be R81. If you want the blue one, you can say blue ring. If you want the pink one, it will be R60. And if you want the white one, you can say white ring. They're beautiful. All different colors on those. I'm really proud of myself for having all of those. That's really cool. Sometimes when I get things in different colors... Um, you know, it just depends on like how you, um, how you style it when you really fall in love with the ring. It's really good to like have it, um, to have multiples of the different colors. Oh, thank you ladies. Oh, okay. 45 minutes. Okay. Perfect. We'll go with four, 15 minutes more. This one is an art deco ring. You can say silver ring for this one. Silver ring. Super pretty. It's got those hematite crystals in the center and all of that detail on the side. I call it Art Deco because it's, it's called something deco. It's really, really pretty. So that one will be um, silver ring for this one. I don't know if you'll want that one. Let's see. We've got a black stone ring. This one's got a black stone in the center. And this is fairly new. You see that little like rosette on the side there and like the little feathers so that's really pretty. That's an all black stone ring. Black stone ring for that one. I've got some copper. Let me show these in copper. Oh, and I have brass over here that I haven't shown. All right, we're just gonna put this tray right here. I don't show it on the trays because these black velvet um, pieces, they kind of, uh, they hold a lot of fuzzies. <laughs> I didn't do the lint rolling today. <laughs> this is a copper flower ring. If you want this one, it will be number 96. 96 for that one. It's all copper and it's got that flower in the center. Number 96 for that one. Next up, we've got, let's do, ooh, this one. This one's really pretty. This one's got a purple stone in the center. It's like a purple, um, deep purple, a skinny stretch back ring, like purple crystal. Those beautiful gems kind of hanging above and below that big gem in the center. That's a really pretty teardrop one. Let me put this on. Look at this. How cute is that? So if you like this one, it will be number 70 
Number 70 for that one. That's what that looks like. Number 70. Next we've got, ooh, this one here on this side. This is like a nude colored stone. Nude in the center and then that beautiful silver piece all the way around, like a silver detail for that one. That one is going to be number 13. 13 for this one. All right, next up I've got, ooh, this is really gorgeous. I've got two of these available. This is an opal stone, opal stone in purple. And actually, I think that this earring over here is going to match up perfectly with it. Let's look. You see this and the ring? Oh my gosh, this is perfect. Look at how gorgeous that is. We should have done earrings tonight too. Let's see. Let's move this out of the way so you can see it on the on the plank. I like this little wood plank, watch. Look at that, that is so freaking cute. And then <laughs> here's the ring to match. So if you want this little set, you can say purple set. Isn't that adorable? That is super cute, purple set for that one. All right, what other rings do I have on here? I have some um, gold ones. This is absolutely one of my favorite ones because whenever I wear gold, sometimes it doesn't have any bling on it. So I just want a, a you know classic gold ring. Now you can wear it with the point up or the point down depending on how you want to style it. Hold on, show it to you like this or like this. So if you want this one, you can say gold point and I'll know you'll want this one, gold point ring. If you guys want me to show earrings, I can pull some. <laughs> Why not? We're already live. This one here is a flower ring in gold, and it's got the stretch back in the um, the skinny stretch back. Love the skinnies. Super pretty. It's like a dome ring. So if you like this one, you can say gold flower. Gold flower for that one. This one has some bling on it. Look at that. This is one of those bar rings, and then it's got like those beautiful crystals. This looks like a expensive ring. It's got, almost looks like it's stacked, you know? Like these are just bar rings that have been stacked together. So that one's gonna be R77. R77 for that one. This is a cutie. This one's got these cutie little purple stones, and it's all crystal studded in the center. And it is also a skinny stretch back. So if you like this one, you can say purple skinny. <laughs> purple skinny for that one. Look how cute that is. Oh, Sharon, yes, I've got a ton. I've been showing some. I'll show you the other ones. This is purple skinny for that one. Is this one number 70? Number, um, what did I get for that one? I don't even remember. Oh, gold flower. Gold flower for that one. Oh, you want number 70. I got you, Sharon, for that one. I know which one it is. Okay, let's do... This is in brass. And this one is also a skinny one. It's just a really pretty little diamond in the center. And you've got the skinny back. That one is adorable. Oh, come on. Focus for me. There you go. So if you want this one, you can say brass skinny, brass skinny for that one. Then I've got another one in brass. This one's got a lot of texture to it, kind of like crisscross. To be honest, it almost looks like tree branches to me. It's got like a really cool design, like a crisscross grungy look. So this is going to be um, brass, uh, grunge brass for that one. <laughs> I'm running out of numbers over here. Grunge brass for this one. I love that one. This is the exact same one as the one that I showed you. Oh, no, it's not exactly the same, actually. It's a little different. It's got little different flowers. Let me look. Or is it the same? Oh, no, it is exactly the same. It is exactly the same. I thought it had different flowers, but no. This one just looks more of like an antique finish. And then the gold one is all gold. 
It doesn't have an antique finish to it. So you can even say this is antique gold, the brass one. And then you've got the gold one. So these, you can say brass flower or gold flower. Brass flower or gold flower for those. Those are pretty. And they are both skinny stretch. I've been showing a ton, Sharon. You'll have to watch the replay so you can see the ones at the very beginning. This one here has butterflies, you guys. This is adorable. Hold on. I have to show this tonight. <laughs> this is such a cute one. So this one's got little butterflies on the side. And it's got the white stone in the center. If you have any white stone jewelry, this is going to be perfect to match. Those little butterflies on the side are adorable. You can say white butterfly if you want this one. White butterfly. That is super cute. Super cute little ring. Let me put it on. There it is. White butterfly for that one. Next, I have this one that's got little purple stones on it. And then it's got like a silver crisscross. So it almost looks like a stacker too, like you stacked it. It's got a bigger, thick stretch back. And then those cute little purple stones. If you like this one, I'm going to give it this number because even though it's backwards. Well, let me see. Can I show it to you like that? Oh, man, barely. It's going to be number 130. 130. <laughs> These are printed backwards so I can show them while I'm live with the front-facing camera. But I'm using the back-facing camera today. <laughs> 130 for that one. I think it's best to use the back-facing camera whenever um, I'm showing rings because you guys can see all of the beautiful details on them. So this is um, brass ring for that one and then the gold one. Sharon wants the brass one. You got it, girl. Let's see. If I've hit, when I hit my hour mark, you guys let me know, okay? This is a gold one and it's got like a little tiara on top with a little peak and then that crystal in the center. Also, an update on invoices. A lot of you have been getting your invoices. If you haven't gotten it yet, it's probably because I still, you're on my list. Like, I still need to send it. I was clearing carts today, so um, I sent out invoices. And today starts a new shopping week, okay? So I won't invoice again until Wednesday of next week. So you have all week to shop starting today, Thursday until next week on Wednesday. And then if you pay your invoice before Friday, it ships tomorrow, Friday. If you don't pay it before Friday, it ships on Monday. OK, so if you want it shipped out quicker, you pay before tomorrow. One oh eight for this one. One zero eight. That one is super cute. I love that gold one. OK. I think I might have hit my mark. Let me know. Let me see what else. Oh, man, we've showed a lot of rings today, huh? I'm going to show some other white stone ones. This one here is similar to the one I showed you before that kind of curls up. But this one's got more of an elongated um, white stone in the center, all silver. That will be R20, R20. R20 for that one. I'll put it like this so you can see it. <laughs> R20. This has white stone also. This is going to be R8. But this one, the silver part, has all of that beautiful filigree. Gorgeous. And those big three white stones in the center. So that's going to be R8. R8 for that one. This was from Fashion Fix. I love this. It's got those dotted details and those three white stones. And some, I think they're like a circle stone. I think that one might be a teardrop stone. They're really pretty though. Love the, de the detail on this. Love the dotted design. That is also a big stretch back. If you want this one, you can say white, um, white ring or here, I'll give it a number. That might be easier. It will be 163. Can you see it through there? 163. <laughs> 163 for that one. All right. I want to definitely pull more from um, this big bin that I have over here. So get ready because next week or this shopping week here, 
we've got some good ones coming up because I, I have a whole bin of rings that I haven't shown you guys. So I wanted to do a recap of the ones that um that I have available on my ring trays and then start showing you some new ones. These here are is a um, skinny stretch back ring and I just got this one in today actually. What is it called? It's called Extra Side of Elegance in White. If you want this one, you can say extra, and I'll know you'll want this one. This is so cute. It comes in different colors, too. Like, it came in, like, a blue and a green. I'm hoping to get it in different colors. But this is a good one. When I say stack, because you can always wear multiples, you know, wear one on one finger and one on the other. So that one is extra. That's a cute one. All right, you guys, I think with that one, I will leave you. Thank you so much for hanging out with me tonight. I appreciate you. Um, as always, make sure that you are sharing my videos out. It really, really, really helps me out when you guys share publicly onto your Facebook um, timeline. Uh, it might get people who haven't seen my videos to see them and, um, and to bring me new shoppers, new faces. Feel free to invite your friends to like my business page. It also really helps me out. I'm trying to get to a thousand likes and we're at 713, I think. Oh my gosh. Or something a little bit less than that. So we're almost like, we're so close. I mean, we've grown the business page this month. And we're, you know, almost to the end. We've, we've got like nine or 10 days to the end of the month. So whatever likes I get are going to help me so, so very much. Um, because I want to get to a thousand likes on the business page. That's the goal. <laughs> and I was going to, I tried to do it in May, but we're slowing down a little bit. So any help is um, appreciated. I would love for you guys to help me out um, and invite your friends to like the page. Um, other than that, wait out for that invoice. It's coming if you haven't received it. If you're watching the replay, thank you so much for watching the replay. I appreciate you. And thank you for... Um, sticking along with me on this new style of live video tonight tomorrow we will be back with our regular lives every day at 8 30 you guys know y'all can catch me and um i love you all thank you for being here with me tonight um as always remember to be a pineapple where's my little pineapple here you are here's the pineapple <laughs> always remember to be a pineapple stand tall wear your crown and be sweet on the inside because that's where it counts i love you good night bye